And today, in Alan Wake and the Bulldozer of Doom, we read... The darkness surged towards me, sucking everything loose from the ground into its depths. Tugging at my clothes, I saw the flare. The kidnapper had dropped and threw myself towards it. Just as I felt my feet leave the ground, the darkness embraced me with the force of a tornado. Somehow I managed to light the flare. The darkness roared and cast me away. I fell towards the dark waters of the lake far below. Oh. Oh. Is that a lake over there? Oh, it is. How lovely. I cannot wait to fall into it later today. Or is it tomorrow? Oops. Oh, did I break that? Crud. Oh, don't worry, people. It's all good. Just gonna grab some stuff, because I know it's there. And I'm just gonna nonchalantly walk over here. Because nothing will possibly go wrong! Oh, dearie me. That is a pissed off bulldozer. Oh, run! Oh, don't run me over, it's rude. Uh, press button. Oh dear. Oh! Fine, I'll kill it. Gorsh game. You make this so hard on me. I want to be a nice pacifist and not kill awesome machinery, but nope. You just gotta go and ruin that for me. A ruin. Can I jump on this? Oh dear. Deary me. Ow. Jump. Come on out. Oh no. Oh no. Suck it, Trebek. Oh, it can break fences. That's a good sign. I refuse to be defeated by. Oh. That's kind of disappointing. And it was already over. Oh, the game's slowing down a little. It's not appreciating... So many enemies all about. Alright, I'm gonna give myself props there. That was pretty sweet. Turn and kill. Well, now since we've destroyed everything here, Man, I wanted to be so cool the first time, just like, you know, ditch, just like, be out here. But nope, game's all like, gotta be proper, man. Gotta fight the boss. Although you can totally easily do what I was gonna do. Just run over there, press the button, run back out, then run back to it. And all will be good. But nah. We, we killed, we killed the bulldozer. I feel kind of bad. You know, I have to wonder, if the bulldozer was taken over by the Taken, where would it go to hide during the day when it, did, when it had to get rid of the light? Or just hide inside a shed or something? A giant bulldozer. Don't mind me! I'm just hiding out in this shed! Oh dear, what if you're like, walking in, walked into that shed and just like rams you? Like, fuck! Don't kill me! Alright, so everyone, oh! So not everyone. Okay, I was gonna say, uh, let's, when this time when I drive, let's not break the car instantly. Turns out, no, I was wrong. I can. It was not that bright before. I'm calling bullshit. You you probably fell asleep in that car again, Alan. So did we get to drive the car, Alan? You gonna let me drive the car? No, Alan's probably not gonna let me drive the car after last time. Totaled like three or four cars, didn't I? Oh, postcard picture. Bam. There. Perfect. Oh, welcome to Bright Falls. Oh, hey, it's actually like... Wait, where's the sun? Because, alright, we're going to talk some lighting here, people. You should only be able to see a shadow that strongly. The sun was like right there-ish. And it would have to be like out. Which it's not. Oh, is that it right there? There it is. Uh, I don't know. I don't really buy that. Oh, Jesus. Shadow click disappears and it's back. Good draw distance. Good draw distance. Can I get in the car? Oh, yeah. The room. Thud. I'm so good at driving. 
Oh, we're ditching this game. It's not worth it. This game sucks. Oh, dear. Huh. Wow. I could have sworn we came from this way. Wow. I'm beginning to think that darkness just might be the game programmers trying to prevent you from going anywhere else. I really enjoy it like that. The, the original idea of this game is supposed to be like a free roaming game, so you'd just be driving around like this. And it'd be kind of like uh, Twin Peaks. It's called Twin Peaks. A totally awesome show. I'm trying to remember, is there any enemies during the day here? I don't think there is. Vroom, vroom. I should slow down. Oh, there's a car. See, I'm going over here because I feel I have sense a disturbance in the force. Oh, I guess not. I was being helpful. There'd be like some items there. And see, I really like this game. Like this game looks nice in the daylight. I mean, it looks nice at nighttime, of course. Oh, geez, this car turns a lot sharper. But I mean. Just a look at these uh, graphics. But the horrible thing about these graphics, though, is they only see them rarely, and it's for short moments during the daylight, like right now. Hey, that's not a letter, that's a, just a very bright splotch on a dark rock. Actually, I like to argue with the programmers on this, because, see, that rock should not be that brightly lit if the ground is that brightly lit. Anyway, I don't care. I am Alan Wake, car extraordinaire, driving to victory in my awesome car. With precision driving and getting... <laughs> Such high amounts of momentum from low, I mean, such high amounts of airtime from such low amounts of m momentum is pretty crazy. I like that car over there, though. But we're gonna go in here because there's a radio! Everyone likes radios. Oh, dear, I thought the game froze. Oh, Pat was detained? Broski, I am sorry. The G-Man- oh shit, G-Man's no good. That guy's gonna kidnap you, Pat. You're gonna be you're gonna be the next Gordon Freeman. Gordon Freeman! Well, I'm glad you're safe. Um, oh, you're peeved too? Don't worry, man, I'm peeved too. I am peeved out of my gourd. Well, that's good. Alright, well, I'm glad you're safe. Alright, good thing he's going to be all about talking to us. But for now, I wish we could turn the radio on in the car. Oh, Jesus, this car has, has good... I regret not keeping the first car I had. Both of these cars are horrendous. Horrendous. Not horrendous, but horrendous. There's no D because you can't drive. Uh... Hey, this car does not have license plate number on it. That is not a legal car to drive around in. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. Sonic to get out of this car. This sucks. Let's go steal this person's car. Well, we should probably ask them first, so... We'll, we'll go up and... Inquire on purchasing their car for the night. It's not night, it's morning. You don't have to worry about night. All is good in the world. Uh oh. It's another empty place. Another radio! Wait, is that popcorn? I can't tell what that thing is. It's like a. Uh, I guess it's like a hot plate. Alright, you know what? I'm not very interested in listening to you guys talk, so no offense, Pat. It was nice to talk to you, Pat, but we're gonna. Since this person's obviously been killed by the Taken, we can take his car because he does no longer exist as a human being. So his car is ours to drive in. Aw, uh, yeah. 
Let's get to going. Vroom. The oh jeez. <laughs> I'm a good driver. Don't question my driving pro. Oh, I want to go there. See, look how good I am at stopping. I just told the car I wanted to go there, and look, it went there even faster than I did. Such a good car. This place looks suspicious. So let's do some platforming. Dear God, no, platforming kind of sucks. Well, no, platforming doesn't suck. Platforming with Alan Wake game mechanics would suck. Uh, why? Why did you stop? <laughs> Dork. For Mott, spying on the rider on the ferry had been a disappointment. His boss had made that wake out to be something special, but Mott had been impressed. He'd gotten a good look, long look out of that wife, though, and liked what he saw. Mott fantasized about goading Wake into a fight, but it had happened. Still, he'd get his chance to if the rider had anything in him. He'd been promised as much. Oh, that guy sounds kind of like a dick. I oh, know, he was a dick. We did meet him on the boat. He was that guy who I annoyed. He was calling me like a city yupper. Or boy. Ooh. Ooh, I want to try for it. Ha! Oh. Oh. It was quiet. Too quiet indeed. Alright, let's go drive ourselves over to the... <laughs> oh, man. The, someone came and stole the hood while we were inside. I knew people were scrapping for metal pretty harsh these days, but I didn't think they were scrapping that hard. Alright, come on, we can do this. We're a racing game. Yeah, racing! Ra oh, racing! Oh, uh, how far back am I going? Oh, uh, do I have to pick up that manuscript again? Uh, no, I don't. Awesome. Alright. So, guys, it's time for some speed trials. We're gonna go so fast, no one's gonna know what happened. they will be like, whoa, I thought this was a 10 hour game, but you did it in 5 minutes. I'm like, I know. Because I am drifting. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm going backwards. That's what I meant to do. Yeah. Driving backwards. I'm totally pro at it. Uh, parked. Perfect. Perfect parking. Oh uh, yeah. Ooh, it's museum time. There's a lot of boards to read. Oh, I triggered this this uh, talk event from up there by jumping at this. That's pretty cool. All right, so I guess next time I shall see you guys at the coal museum. Now remember, bring your kitties. And let them roll around in the coal so much that you can't see them in the dark.